Hello DC fans, this is JR369. Welcome back for another pop review. Today I'll be taking a look at the Pop Heroes DC Bombshells number 225 Chase variant of Catwoman, the purple variant, by Funko. Now take a look at the box here. Now the box is pretty much unlike the um well you know the whole pop box I reviewed, but this is the bombshells wave. You get the Pop Heroes and does say DC Comics Palm Shells. You can see the window that exposing the pop. On the side here, you get the image of Catwoman here. On the other side, you get the image of Catwoman there. On the back, you get the like the little artwork here of Catwoman. And there's other pops in this wave like Batwoman, Supergirl, Hawkgirl, and Poison Ivy. I think there's wave two of this pop, right? If I'm not mistaken. Oh wait, I think this is wave two, right? No. I, I don't know. I'm I'm confused. So that's about it for the box. Now let's release Catwoman Selena Kyle out of the box. Here we got Catwoman out of the box. Now take a look at the pop here. Now the pop here, the head sculpt on her. I mean you can see the little wraps around her hair here it does have the uh, little pointed cat ears similar to the cat ears that her mask that she wore you can see the little cat silver thing right here you get the little furs or feathers from a bird i'm not sure who are these from I'm not sure what these are supposed to be either feathers or furs because of the cat you can see there's a little mole right here printing on her head you can see some of the uh earrings per pearl earrings right if i'm not mistaken i have no idea all over each of the ears here and on the neck area here you can clearly see the sculpted pearl necklace here uh, they're supposed to be bruce wayne's mother's pearl necklace huh probably she stole them now her purple dress here. I'm pretty sure they the reason why they made her purple dress is because of the um of the uh the night the long Halloween version of Catwoman where she wears that purple outfit in the comics. You can see the little black gloves all over her arms here. You get the you get the little whip there with the little texturing sculptings there. You get the little oops. You get the little heels with the little straps there as well. You can see like the little hole here. You can see the toe there sculpting on. And on the bottom there's like the legal stuff here and there's a peg on the bottom feet and I'm pretty sure there's a serial number there on her on her foot on her right foot. Overall, not bad looking pop on her. Pretty much, it's some. I think Funko is supposed to be make like the one from the the long Halloween version of Batman, Catwoman from the comics. Who knows? I think that's the. I think that's the point because I already knew her from the her black outfit from the films. Uh, but I'm pretty sure this is from the long Halloween comics where Catwoman wears an outfit. But for a pop here, it's not too bad at all. I mean, there's like a little bit of messy, messy jobs on, on her. Like, there's like a messy paint. If, like, we're behind the uh, glasses here with the eye area there. Right here. But the pop itself is still still looking not too bad at all. Not too bad. I really do like this pop. I really like Catwoman. And if you're a big fan of Catwoman, then I highly recommend getting this pop. If on eBay, probably cheaper since it is worth 10 bucks on Pop Price Guide. It's a not bad looking pop. Not too bad. Totally recommend getting this pop. 
So that's about it. Make sure to tune in for new videos daily. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, share this video, and comment on this video. Make sure to turn on the bell icon so you can be notified of new videos after you subscribe so you won't miss any new uploads and you can be part of the notification squad. Finally, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both links will be in the description down below. That's all I can say. This is the Pop Heroes DC Bombshells number 225 Chase variant of Catwoman in her purple outfit Pop by Funko. And this is JAR369. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next review.